and I had seen him teach. I actually hired him to teach sculpture in the art department. He related so well to kids, not only our students, but to visitors, that I thought he would be someone who could work with me to design a program for the community. I'm a teacher at Phillipsburg High School. Been there for seven years. These are some of our advanced art studio. Um, the kids that plan on going to college. Um, we bring them here to do the Lafayette Martin experience. It's a great opportunity for them to excel when they go to college. They're really serious minded art students. They get to work with professionals in magazines and publications. Um, I get to see firsthand what an artist's life is like, learn new techniques, work with other artists, and we're just kind of, you know, raising the bar a little bit, you know, kind of taking them outside of the box and um, giving them this college experience at a high school level. Soundboard form, an interpreter, in billboard form. In billboard form, in billboard. right? And I noticed all of you did a fairly good job of uh, keeping to that format. Um, all right, well, I, it's really right there, it's all there. Um, I'm Craig Stevens, I'm art director for Adams Outdoor Advertising. We are collaborating with Jim Toyo on his project uh, here at Lafayette, uh, hoping to give the students some real world insight, some actual application for the project that they're working on. Will you use this for? Yep. For your portfolio? Heck yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so well connected in Easton and in the immediate area around him <clears throat> that he was uh, ideal for this. So he and I worked out a program with the approval of our We went and got funding for this thing and we put it in motion uh, with part uh, hope. We didn't know whether we had enough money, we didn't know exactly what it would look like. But even by word of mouth, the adult part of the program, the first night we opened these free open classes, 60 people showed up without any, any invitation, no formal invitation, just word of mouth. They, they get to see artists uh, a little bit above them, and then they get to see artists and professors and, and you know, some of the residents that are here, so they get to see things that they normally wouldn't see, that you have to travel quite a distance for, and they're receiving that week right here. So Lafayette offers, um, brings it to them. We want to give young students in the region, young high school students, anywhere from uh, Phillipsburg, Belvedere, to Easton, Nazareth, any of those regions, and you know, any, the broad region that, are, that, that is around us, the opportunity for kids to come in here, or for us to bring ideas to the kids about the studio arts, about film, about sculpture, about painting, and give them the opportunity to see more of what's available awesome. and at their fingertips. I want to try to, we're gonna Not just to absorb, but also to take back things and push forward. Because I'd love to bring everyone here. I think the most important thing that you can learn about that is it's just by giving the students the opportunity to see what's else around them that's just beautiful the professional artists that are like practicing that. right within this community it gives them the opportunity to um, push beyond what they know learn more borrow from those artists and see what they can do with those that's new skills really nice are you going to get um bring a um Lafayette has the professors and the students who uh, have the knowledge and the desire to help these students, these young kids. Um, and I'm a conduit for those, for those people. Um, I, I'll help guide them. The community arts program will set up a, a structure so that these kids can, um, can come down here or we can bring people there and expose them to everything we have to offer.